rounds, but moves like a deer. And that kid's got a lot of top end as the kickoff from New Zealand falls. Now it's Emerson, digs the pile, finds the ball out to Luke Masarewa. Chance to get out of their own half. There is Tia Tia to start things out. Masarewa crawls forward. Referee says the ball not available for Boyd Killingworth. So penalty to New Zealand. Masarewa digs it out, flicks it to Fidia Meltzer. Meltzer, back door to Jesse Houston, and Houston is going to answer for New Zealand. I don't know if he took a knee in the back, but watch this offload. One-hander there, and as he hits the line. Great footwork there by Meltzer as well. Let's take a look at this. Attempting to get across the halfway line in the early minutes of this second half. First quarter final, Mason Emerson. La 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 with some famous brothers who've worn the black jersey for the 15s team, all blacks. Masarewa trying to get over the line. A great tackle by Maurice Longbottom who gives up about a foot. There that's been all day for yeah. this Tongan team. Good support lines. He got in behind the ball, kept that alive. He just spilled it forward at the last minute. So, Meltzer. So, Fidia Meltzer with the kickoff. Great kick right into the hands. And out to Tia Tia. And now Meltzer. Meltzer one hands it. And then a good offload there. That's Emerson. Tori now to claim that eighth spot. Look at that. Look at all those four white shirts coming. So Meltzer with the kickoff. And again, Ryasi goes high for the ball, comes down clean with it at the ruck. Kicked through, says the referee. A no-no in the new law variations. <laughs> Fiji. So moving on, Fidia Meltzer wearing the number six. You really become the playmaker. There is Ryasi. Meltzer. Tina. And a nice movement there by New Zealand. Masarewa, he's got one on the corner. By Harmon, the youngster. And the number three, Jordan Highland. Almost takes it into contact, pulls it back out. And there is, once again, it's Harmon. Harmon. Trying to shake the Fijian defender. And then Melter, oh. Fidia Melter, runs into Amanoni Nasila Sila, but bucks off that t contact. And runners bouncing off tacklers. Melter literally bounced backwards and then spun around. The creative, tall, big man that can stand in a tackle in the contact area and deliver the offloads. And this time to a quick two try lead it's about halfway through the first half of this fifth New Zealand a little dart around the corner Fidia Meltzer and Meltzer good speed around the corner Leota guarding Leota comes back and makes the tackle it's essential there's that is the book on American teams right now. They're so physical and so dominating. Leota, ball stolen in the contact area. Another turnover by the Americans. Uncharacteristic for this side. Chris Matina. Great counter ruck there by the United States. I'm not sure if the referee got that call right or not. Pass to Martin Yosefo. Yosefo steps through. One. And Driver challenge the New Zealanders but as it is New Zealand ball 12 12 two minutes to go keep going here as Hamilton goes quickly and he'll finish this will he <laughs> he just got absolutely yeah, smothered yeah. by it so lost it are employing the uh the one lifter approach oh well, there's a sub oh look at that too many players in the field each I think so player error maybe a little bit of um 
missing out on the rules there, but number seven, the playmaker here for the Northland team, making a big gap down the middle, and again, the Northland team threatening the Bay of Plenty line. Looks like number 11 is going over again. He put me on the field. I think if the, the ref catches you, catches you he can, he can uh, send you back to the sideline to put one in. Great tap backs. A big blind for this halfback to take as well. We'll see which way he goes. He comes straight off the back of the scrum, breaks the tackle. Gee, he's strong on his feet. <laughs> Jay, just hold on to the ball. Yeah, hold on to the ball. You could you play territory. Get out of the out of the red zone. Captain on captain now. Yep. I he equal to the task. Puts him down, but great support work there by the Northland team. Will he make it all the way? Oh, reaches oh. out. The ball. ball goes back into the pocket. Looking for the wrist fights. Running nice and straight now. Here's the playmaker again. Inside beats one. He's looking for the cutback. Slows the dummy. Looks on the outside. Finds the inside ball. And it's picked up by Northland. Good momentum here if they've moved the ball wide. They've got a few numbers and the referee's playing advantage. One on one because against some of these players with footwork like that, you're uh, putting yourself in a risky situation. Maltese up with the feed, brings it back to the right hand side. There's a big step up the middle from number seven from, from Northland. X. comes back to Maltese on the outside. He's got one on one here. He steps inside, looking for the offer. Kickoff's so, so important in the sevens as Northland have the ball just outside there. 22 and it's a show and go. Straight through the middle is Zed Maltese from Northland. Steppens. They're taking the ball on the far side. Play right. gets over the re retaining position. Oh, they left the blind side open. That is a big no-no. Number seven from Northland. He's been their playmaker for most of this day and um, you just don't give him opportunities like that.